what is going on everybody bam bam johnny with the real tree lodge and we got a couple more boxes in from the fine people over at magnolia gaming switch play mats the I'm using live focus on my camera right now and I kept on trying to zoom in on the face but check it out so I've got a lot of these kind of damaged uh, edges on some of these cards kind of annoying but it is what it is right now let's uh let's see if we can pull some winners here yeah I really just like the Japanese pack well there we go blood on the snow wouldn't just snow all right, yeah. so uh, he trying to maneuver around the Japanese packs. I know it's not too big of a deal, but it does feel like opening it. it's a little different. Yeah, but these ones have little pull tabs on them again. Oh boy. I feel like you can talk about Blood in the Snow. I guess it's just a really good card. Not so much on, uh, on the value side. Ooh, we got something shiny. We got a plane here. That's our... Another uh, Tibolt Trickery. Is that Tibolt? About $7, $6 card, something like that. Something in that price range. Ooh, everything's kind of blurry today. It's just not a good day to be recording, apparently. Yeah, well, these prices should start to kind of take shape, give or take. Uh, in a week or two, give or take. Who knows? Some of them might come back up. Some of them might drop even further than we thought. Bam. Waking the trolls. I keep in one say walking. Walking the trolls. Taking them out for their evening walk. That frenzied raider. Yeah, there's so much, like on a lot of the uncommons mainly. You got that little neck up there. Thank you, quality control. I guess we'll see uh, if, if maybe it's just the Japanese packs. We shall see. Well, in theory, we'll see. I thought these were going to be American ones. Made in the good old U.S. of A. Little foretell token here. Love these uh, lands still. Bam. Orvar the All Form, our first mythic for today. Uh, it's about like a $7 card, give or take. Here's our first showcase. We'll go make a showcase pile this time. To showcase the show. Okay, okay. Roll the credits. Still have yet to pull uh, the Vorniclex. Um, and also the World Tree is another one we haven't seen yet. Uh, oh, actually the Goldspan Dragon. Yeah, we haven't seen the Goldspan Dragon yet. Oh. What do we got here? Damn. Highland Forest. We got the God of Storytelling. Vega the Watcher. Ruin Crown. Ruin of Flight. Ruin. And a bunch of commons that I'm going to skip past and I'll kind of forget about them. And I'll be playing uh, like a draft or something one day. And someone will beat me up with a common. And I'm like, wow, what set could that be from? And I'll look at it like, oh, that's from one of the sets that we... Bought a ton of cards from. <clears throat> oh. We got the replicating ring token. Snow covered swampy. Ooh, we got a foil old growth troll. It's very shiny. It's very nice. And that's another one of the, I think, the, the Japanese uh, cards are supposed to be a little more vibrant, I believe. No damage on these ones. As long as the damage stays away from the mythics, we'll be good to go. Alright, let me try to speed this up. Ah, I can't find the pull tab. I don't know how I feel about the pull tab. I think it, uh. I don't know. It's just not the same as breaking it down the middle. 
You have the chasm. Uh, didn't read that card. There we go. A little bit of damage. It's like every other pack has it. Rootless Yar. Uh, wait, Yar. <laughs> Stay in school, kids. That's that's not what that said at all. He's like you. Is that you? Hey, babe. Yeah. What does Y E W spell? Yeah, yeah it is you. <laughs> I trust my wife with spelling a lot more than myself. If we have learned one thing from the channel, then my ability to read is less than a first grader. And that's still being generous. Oh, yep, it's you. <laughs> oh, it's you. No, it's you. I think this video is going to probably go up Friday and hopefully everyone's going to get a chance to pick some up if they didn't do any of the pre-release stuff. If they could or couldn't get out of there. Ooh, there we go. We got a nice little foil uh, foil plane. Ooh, there we go. Dragonkin Berserker. What a nice card. What a beauty. Ah. <laughs> Uh, all all the showcase arts fantastic. Squash, that's nice. All right, let me stop doing that. We also tend to have a habit of uh, looking at cards that really aren't that important. That, that pull tap. Oh, there we go. That actually worked out perfectly that time. It's like a little taco. All right, and. Try it. Sanctum. Keep on putting that in the run. All these piles are messed up already. I saw a, a uncommon in the rare spot. Dang it. Replicating ring. Invasion of giants. Ooh, and actually, yeah, so the planes or planeswalker decks. So the commander decks should be out this Friday too. Those are always fun to play. And me and the old lady usually play a couple rounds so they come out. That was exciting. Let's see what... Oh, there we go. It's the first time I actually pulled Nico. Nico Eris. Nico, are you worth anything? Oh, you know, you're around like three bucks or so. Three fifty. Three fifty. It's always nice to have them planeswalkers. What do you do, though? Create a shard token. Hmm. What does a shard token do? Insert shard joke. Oh, okay. Well, it tells you around the card there, but we'll, we'll not worry about that because it's not too terribly important. All right, a little foil basalt of Ravenger. Then we got Cosme, uh, Cosme, God of the Voyage. God of the Voyage, not of the uh, value, though. Still, cool card. Why not? As you can uh, check out online, a couple of online retailers are already doing pre-orders for Time Spiral Remastered. Which, uh, I wasn't there for those sets. So, if there's some cool cards, let me know in the comments what we should be looking for when that uh, set drops. I know they're not going to reprint every single card. Ooh, it's a nice vampire dragon. Set that aside. Show my wife, because it's a cool card. We have the Ice Shaper. We've got a bunch of other cards here. Yeah, oh, look at that guy there. That's a hammer. Like, what are you doing over here, Nico? You're, go to, you're over there. So we got two Mythics so far. We can get four to five more, potentially, I've seen, or I've pulled myself. I think we've done six on a regular... No, we did seven on our first box, I think. I don't know anymore. Everything's kind of a blur. When you open this much product, you just don't remember anymore. Uh, Vargoth Bloodsire. Woo! The old Bloodsire. Yeehaw! Bloodline Pretender. You fake. You ain't real. You a pretender to the crown, boy. Ho, 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 doggy. All right. We're a third of the way there. Whoa. 
Third of the way there. <laughs> Today the enthusiasm is at an all-time high. All right, we got a foil of Valkyrie here. <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> uh, Starheim Unleashed. Is that extended art or borderless? I, I can't remember how that works. Um, but the regular card's like four or five bucks, so that has to be worth something. And it's really cool looking. It's a glimpse of the cosmos, if you will. Glimpse of, yeah, so there's, um, uh, there's potential for, uh, showcase or borderless cards, whatever, in the regular regular boxes and the rumor is that the prices are going up on those regular boxes but you can still go on uh there we go icebreaker cracking you can still go to magnolia gaming and they're pretty decently priced at 89 dollars so get them while they're hot give them while you can where are you at pull tab all right, look at that. That's I hate the pull tabs, except the one on Modern Masters Twenty Five, little cardboard box. That was fine. We'll take that Cyclone Summoner. All right, a uh, Ascent of Worthy Frost Auger. This guy's getting his head chopped off with the Iron Verding. Ooh, that one worked out. Yeah. An angel token. Old planes there. Woo, look at that. Secret God of Favored Showcase. All right. Crush the week. Yes, indeed. Crush the week. <laughs> Including Saturday and Sunday? Shut your mouth. Shut your freaking mouth. Pull tabs feel unnatural. I don't like it. No, sir. Well, Deco defines destiny. And Masked Wood Nexus. All right, we got a showcase Ruin Eyes there. Ruin Eyes. Well, look at you and I can't disguise my Ruin Eyes. <sighs> Not getting the big hits yet, though. Let's give us at least one. We're three mythics deep. Come on. Give me one. That's not one. That's a crazy looking squirrel. But it's not what we're looking for. Yeah. Come on, box. Don't let me down. Don't let me down. Give me some pathways or something. Or Dream Devourer. It's, it's an alright looking card. Yeah. Stop putting that in that pile there, Brian. You got this. Got the Mirror Lake. Kaya's Onslaught. She's whooping that Phyrexian booty. Emphasis on the tay. This pull tab is making all kinds of extra trash. How dare you, Japan. How dare you. Ooh, oh, Bernie Ruined Demon. For our fourth mythic. Yeah. You like <laughs> three bucks a show? Hopefully it'll go up a little bit. If not, <laughs> we got you. We got you anyway. Now you're part of the family. When we move to Providence, Rhode Island, you're coming with us. All right, we can do this. Rally the ranks. Yep. Ruin of speed. We got the frost. Pyre. Hmm. Ugh. Brazen Outlaw. Dang it, Trickster. God of Heist. Fearless Liberator. We got a shiny Vega. 
Cool, cool. Oh, oh got a battle. Got a battle. Where do you stand on our lovely list of cards? Um, well, the regular one's worth like eight, seven or eight bucks. So maybe, maybe something since you're the showcase. Oh, no, I just killed this whole pile. I don't know if we can, we can maybe get one more, possibly two more Mythics. But I am not holding my breath. So let's let's get some pathways. Let's get some. Uh, oh, God of Kinship. That's fine. We'll, we'll mess around with God of Kinship. Ooh, nice looking showcase. We got an Angry Bird and some other fun jazz. We've actually been having a little trouble with this set. Usually, uh. Our first couple of boxes under the last, uh, uh, pretty much all the sets almost. We got, oh, there's a pathway. We got a lot of winners. This one's been a little rough. They made, I can only assume they're making some of the, the chase cards a little hard to get. Making them more or less a chase card. Ooh, another pathway. All right, back to back pathways. It's not bad. I like that. Keep on putting that over there. All right, we got a Blood Sky Berserker. Look at that guy. Uh, Cardor Doom Scourge. We got no damage. Oh, no, we got a little damage on that one. Unfortunate. Unfreaking fortunate. Here's the last bit of our uh, packs here. Man, I hate these pull tabs. Come on. Oh, this one's really. Really messing with me. Look at that. It's not letting go. Here we go. This is going to be a spicy card next. Oh, oh hey, well, it's a foil. Huh. No. <laughs> it's a reckless crew. They don't follow any of the rules. Not even their own. They're reckless. The Colossal Plow. That's my prison name in Rhode Island. In Search of Greatness. What a fun card. I didn't really play around with it, but I'm sure there's some craziness. Ooh. Finn the Fang Bearer uh, going out there on Arena and I'm sure Paper as well. In Search of Greatness. By Friday, maybe even tomorrow, we will be getting our first set booster box in, which I like those. I thought those were really cool. Oh, I can't wait to crack some of those open. I think the list is the same list they had from um, from Rise of Zendikar, but if you get some of the top cards, there's a lot of a lot of cards and there was some value in it. Scroll rack being one of them. That's the only one I can think of off the top of my head. But yeah, but unfortunately, there's like 500 some cards on the list, and you only get maybe eight or nine in a box. It's a search for glory. Dual strike. We got Drott's Helm. Pull the multiverse. All right. Last four packs. As you guys have making it this far, stuck around this entire time. Do the jank camera and the weird auto-focusing and everything else. Probably heavy breathing on my part. <sighs> I appreciate it. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, hit the thumbs down button any number of times. That can be divided by the number two. I guess four will work too. We'll go with four this time. Change it up a bit. Share the video with friends and family. Uh, if you have somebody that might like more magic in their life, send them our way. Come hit the subscribe button. You can follow us on Facebook. That link is down below in the description of this video. Uh, we're almost to 300 followers. It sounds so such a little amount, but everyone starts somewhere. 
We're almost there. Almost at 300. Last two packs. We could maybe... But we could still maybe get another Mythic. We have yet to see the Vorn Vorniclex. Well, you know, the World Tree is only a rare son of a biscuit. Let's do it. Uh, ooh, Eska. Eska's Chariot. Nice. I don't think I've seen that yet. Or I may have seen the regular art. Well, let's make this suspenseful. So let's see. Our Mythics. We got five. We got five. We got a showcase. We got extended art or portal list, whatever it is. Here we go. It's for all the bacon. Huh. Someone we still kept the video under 30 minutes. We're at the 20 minute mark. All right. Oh. Okay. Just right there it is. Doom Scar. Uh, three, maybe four bucks. That's the last card we're going to end this on, huh? Hmm. This one was a little light. Like I said, we're not having the best of luck with this set. But they may have also actually increased the odds of getting some of the bigger, more rare cards, which is kind of nice, I guess. So those cards will stay, stay in good value. Anyway, you guys take it easy. Later.